Day two, Florida Keys. That's a big smoker king. That's my personal best, I believe. That's a nice fish. Nice job. I guess on. 30, 40 pounds, probably. What do you say, Tom? We're what, about 12 miles southeast? Key West? Is that where we are? Yeah. Alana's bundled. We stopped in town yesterday, got the appropriate gear. Got the jacket. Uh huh. Prepared. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I think that's a blue runner though. Really? I think. Sure feels like it. It's got a little bit of size to it though. Yeah. Hey, you hit it good. Nah, it might be. I think it's gonna be a blue runner. Oh no, yellowtail. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Nice one. Now we're talking. Good job, huh? Yeah, now we're talking. That's a nice one. A little more sizable. Barely hooked them too. Look at that. Mm. Now we're talking. Ooh, somebody, somebody bit them. See that? Yeah. Hey Tom, this guy's got a nice little chunk out of him. Oh, there you go. Ed's got a good one. Yeah. Oh yeah. Look at the bend in that rod. Woo. Oh. Oh, 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 look at that one. That's a nice one there, That's bud. Nice now one. you're talking. Yeah. All right, guys, so we weren't getting bit, and then Ed noticed that if you just cast upstream a little bit, it was difficult to see which way the chum was going, but we finally realized it's actually going towards the bow. And we just didn't have our baits sitting where these yellow tail are holding, so. We're back in them here. Just cast off the bow. Slowly drift it down. So the fish must be holding way back in there, really. I just got smoked. I got a nice one. Unfortunately, I didn't have the camera on, but... But, uh, yeah, we thought we were just about to move, and then here we go. So let's see. Look at that. We may be on to something here. Yeah, Ed might be on to something. I think they're... Good job, Ed. I think you might be right, but I, I casted way towards the bow. Yup. And look at that. Yup, and I let it get way away from the boat, and bingo. And look, he's spitting up chum. So maybe that's it. They're just hanging a little, a little far further up. All right. Oh yeah, are we getting... What do we got here, Chris? I don't know, huh? Okay guys, so as you can see here, uh, getting the gaff ready to roll. I knew this was something different and honestly after several months of not having gaffed anything, I was really actually ready to roll. So you can see me uh, ready to go with the gaff. I was gaffing anything that, that came anywhere near the boat, provided it was legal. So Ed pulled in a really nice mutton snapper here and uh, just an absolutely awesome fish. So Super cool. That was the biggest one I had ever seen. Absolutely beautiful. What's 
set, huh? Yeah. We're just casting towards the bow there. Like I said, they're probably holding way out there. Whoa! Just got bit, Tom. Go ahead, bud. Yeah, I just got smoked. I don't know if he's on there, but he smoked it. He smoked it. I'll see the bobber. There he goes. Uh, yeah, he's on. Come on. Come on. Ready, Lana? Come on. He's on. Ready? Come on. There you go. Got a girl, just stay tight. There you go. Okay. That's probably a king. Or a cuda, right? I think she's okay. There you go, huh? Yeah, yeah. Good job. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh my god. Stay tight. There you go. Let's see, let's get a gaff. I think it might be a big Cuda. Okay guys and girls, so at this point I actually knew that this was definitely a Barracuda and that we were gonna release this fish. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't you know, pull this fish out of the water and get a real nice uh, picture. Uh, again, I'm, I'm not harvesting this fish, so if I don't have to take it out of the water, there's no real need to. Uh, we pulled this fish boat side, uh, cut the hook real quick, and she swam away just fine. So again, no need to pull this fish out of the water and take 18 million photos. Um, really neat catch by my wife. Yeah. Oh yeah, baby. Yeah. You said you you saw him, huh? I saw a splash right under the. Oh, okay. You got that? Chris on video here, fighting something. Yeah. 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 Don't throw the head back. Okay. Coming up. Yeah? Yeah. Got some shoulders, that's for sure. Yeah, I think it's another nice one. Tell you what though, he made that. That water rod sounded like a king, huh? Yeah. Let's hope it's a mackerel. Yeah. Was this on top? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at him. It looks big. Look at that. If that's a king, that's a monster. I can't imagine that's another king. I mean, another. Look how big. Whoa. Dude, I think it's a king, guys. That's a big king. Yep. One yep, it's a big kingfish. Oh, wow. Look at that. Right, that big thing? mother. Oh, Camp's right next to you, Tom. Ready, bud? He's not hooked real good. That's a big, big smoker king. Hey. Woo -hoo -hoo, oh, that's a beast. <laughs> yeah, baby. That's a big one. Nice deeper the water, the bigger the fish. That's yeah, right. Baby. <laughs> Day two, Florida Keys. That's a big smoker king. That's my personal best, I believe. Okay guys and girls, so the wind is absolutely howling, so you can't really hear exactly what I'm saying here, but this is definitely my personal best king mackerel. I'm guessing anywhere between 25 to 35 pounds, uh, and I've held up a few fish in my day, so that was just my estimate. Okay, so just a few weeks prior to me having fished with Ed here, he had dislocated his shoulder. Uh, he was out here in three to four foot seas teaching my wife and I had to catch yellowtail. You can see him there. He's kind of favoring his left arm there. Super impressive. Oh, fun. Not only that, I uh, decided to test 
the throttle out on uh, Tom's boat, which I had never driven before. And uh, I drove Ed backwards and really slammed his uh, affected shoulder. So, sorry, Ed. Um, but, man, was I impressed at how he not only handled these seas, but, you know, beat the heck out of me fishing. So, good job, bud. And, again, good to meet you. So I just throw it off that off the starboard bow, let it drift way back. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work. Come here, baby. Let's see ya. Oh, ho, ho, barely had him hooked. Look at that. Barely had him hooked. Oh yeah, there you go. Yeah, got that one more, baby. Got that one more. All right. You know I was getting bit there. Oh yeah. Not too bad. All right. There you go. Be my last drop, I think. Is that right? You want me to pull in? No, no, you're good. I just feel like I don't want to get too greedy. I said one more, and I got one more. I'm happy. Look how pretty they are. Yeah, just squirting out, Sean. They're just so pretty. You know, they pull good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they're just beautiful. That's a nice one too. What do they call them when they're like your forum? What do they say? They say it's a flag. A flag, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's, they're talking that, about bigger than that. Even bigger than that, right? Yeah, they gotta be 20 inches. Oh, okay. I'll tell you what though, we got a pretty nice brace of fish there. We did great. We did great. What a good day. Yeah. Uh-huh. Six. Let's do this. Yeah. Woo! Day two. Certainly a little better quality, that's for sure. Not quite as many numbers as yesterday, but uh, better quality for sure. Big king mackerel, nice mutton, 19 or 20 keeper yellowtail. I'll take it. What a beautiful day out there. There's yeah. huge tarpon swimming around. We got pelicans eyeing us up. certainly paid for it on the way back in though. We got our butts kicked. That's right. We got soaked. My wife did a great job. She was a trooper. So I'm going to start filleting up these fish and uh, we're going to take them and get another nice meal tonight. So we'll check you out later. See ya. It's awesome. Oh yeah. It'll be good on that HD. Yeah. Almost. We're going to get a couple carcasses and do it. Do the hose, right? The, uh, the, uh, the birds are going to go after them. Are you going to throw anything away? Are you going to throw anything away? Just get away. So right here, Tom was telling me that if we spray the pelicans with water, they'll stay away from the carcasses and the fillets and the skin, and the tarpon will come up. So it's a little game we're playing. I'm throwing all the scraps over the side, and uh, he's spraying the pelicans so that the tarpon have a chance to come up. And man, as that sun came down, boy, did those tarpon come up. There were 100, 150-pound tarpon just taking these scraps right out of my hand. It was one of the neatest things I had ever seen. And I just wanted to jump in the water with them and snorkel. But unfortunately, I didn't have my gear. I almost dove in just, just for the fun of it. But uh, super, super cool. This fillet. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Look at them. Oh, my God. 
Holy cow, look at him, hon. Are you videoing this? I am. Oh my God, look at them. They're huge. Yeah. They probably don't like me talking like that. Oh, look, they, that one, that one knocked the other one out of the way. Oh, did you see him eat it? That is one of the neatest things I have ever seen. I want to swim with them. Look at them. Look how big yeah. they are. Give, give another one. That was so cool. They're like 200 pounds. They are big. They are no joke, man. I see you, boys. I see you. I see you. I wasn't my best, but it's alright. I know I cut the head on that. Then you get two of them now. Mm hmm. Get out of here. All right, watch the fish. Get. Oh, what did you get that? Oh, yeah. Did you see him come right up for it? Dude, they are huge. Yes. Yeah. That is one of the neatest things I think I have ever seen in my life. Look at him. Did you see him come right up for that? Wowzers. Dude, that is just neat. Ouch. That is beyond cool. I can't believe it. Chris is laying up the fish. Mm-hmm. It's like I'm it's like I'm back home, baby. Yep. Doing my thing. That's what I was meant to do. Alright, we're done. Yeah, go ahead. Go home, man. You did good. You get another diamond. I owe you like 15 diamonds, I think, at this point. Look how cool. What's up, boys? Bunch of pelicans I'm feeding, and right underneath them are 200-pound tarpon. That is just so cool. Look at the tarpon right underneath them. Look at them. Right underneath them. There's tarpon. Look how big they are. Wow. Holy shnikes. That is just too cool. huge yeah that is one of the neatest things I think I have ever seen in my life look at him did you mm -hmm. see him come right mm -hmm. up for that wow pretty neat all right let me get some bags all right so cheers son so, that was a pretty awesome day. Pretty awesome. It's pretty uh, hard to sum up how good that was, but that was pretty awesome. So guys, I am supremely lucky. My beautiful young wife stuck it out today. It was cold, windy. She got soaked, but she was a trooper. We fished from, well, we left the dock around 8 a.m. 8, 8.30. Did get back to around 5. We got our butts kicked on the way back. It was every bit of four foot right on top of each other. Uh, but we had a great day. We were able to push out a little deeper. We fished 60 to about 85 foot. Um, again, this isn't my home water, so I'm not all that knowledgeable. But uh, we were able to get a little deeper, which really helped today. Uh, you really had to work to get them to bite, but when they did, they were really good sized fish. Um, again, you can see my personal best, King Mackerel, and uh, Alana was able to get a really big uh, Barracuda, so that was pretty cool. Uh, cheers again, hon. You did great today. Alright, so first course is conch fritters. Um, 
These are absolutely delicious. I've had these um, a couple times, but these are particularly good. So this is our first course to end day two. We've got conch fritters and uh, fresh fish will be coming out soon, but these are absolutely delicious. I've been out of the keys. Check these out. Uh, one day I want to get down here and maybe catch them myself. Um, learn how to make them. That'd be pretty cool. But uh, yeah, it's really delicious. Oh yeah, there we go. Yeah, man, get into it. You can have some if you want to. Yeah, we can't eat all that. Did you bring that in? Yeah, yeah, that's all yellowtail snapper that we caught today. Yeah. Looks like we got the panko over here. Panko. Blackened. Blackened. Grilled. Grilled. There you go. Sides go along. Salad. Mixed veggies. So try out. Even it out. Yeah. What do you want to try? Go ahead. Show me how it is. You ordered the panko, so let's see. I'm gonna try the panko. First. Yeah, that looks good. Mm. Good. Bingo. All right, well, I'm hungry myself, so I'm gonna dig in. Look at that. Kiwas, baby. Fresh fish.